not Lee Min Ho, by Yong Jun and Song Hai Kyo have admitted to dating in the past. In recent news, Song Hai Kyo's former lover, known for his good looks that even outshone Lee Min Ho at the peak of his career, has caused a sensation. Recently, Rumors of Lee Minho and Song Hai Kyo dating have resurfaced after the two were spotted attending a fashion show by a famous fashion brand held in the United States. They were seen sitting together, chatting, and sharing intimate moments, giving hope to many fans that they could be the next golden couple in the Korean entertainment industry. Following the viral social media interaction between the two, many people have speculated about their relationship including the sighting of matching rings and traveling together. However, both Lee Min Ho and Song Hai Kyo have remained silent about these rumors. Interestingly, Song Hai Kyo had a famous rumored significant other in the past, and that was none other than Act 2 by Yong Joon. Before becoming the king of Korean entertainment, Bai Yong Joon was a renowned actor who had been linked to several female celebrities due to various dating rumors. One such rumor was with Lee Ji after they worked together on the project Taiwang Sa Shinji in 2007. To clarify the situation and clear up the rumors, Bai Yong Joon revealed an incident where he was mistakenly reported to be out with Lee Ji when, in fact, it was Song Hai Kyo with him. Addressing the rumors, the actor from Winter Sonata explained that the paparazzi had misunderstood the situation. He emphasized that the girl he was sitting with at the restaurant was not Lee Jia but Song Hai Kyo. Bai Yong Joon shared, At the time, I was sitting, having a drink, and chatting with my stylist and Song Hai Kyo. However, the next day, the news reported that I was dating Lee Jia. Upon hearing the news, Song Hai Kyo playfully called her older brother Bai Yong Joon and jokingly asked, Do I really look so much like Lee Jia? Or maybe your stylist looks so much like Lee Ji that the paparazzi didn't notice me. This incident highlights the close and friendly relationship between Bai Yong Joon and Song Hai Kyo. In reality, the two had previously worked together on the project Hotel A in 2001, which solidified their bond as good friends. Many years have passed since then, and Bai Yong Joon, now 51 years old, is happily married to Park Sujin since 2015 with two children. He decided to step away from the showbiz spotlight and move to live in Hawaii with his family. On the other hand, Song Hai Kyo is still single. She went through a divorce with Song Joon Ki in 2019, and her life has taken a different path since then. Wishing you continued success and happiness with your family, by Yong Joon. Especially in the new year, may you have new projects, including new films, as I've always enjoyed watching you on screen. Your talent and dedication have been an inspiration, and I look forward to seeing more of your work in the future. Cheers to a prosperous and joyful year ahead. By Yong Joon, the iconic Hallyu star and his enduring legacy. By Yong Joon, often referred to as the Yon Sama by his adoring Japanese fans, is a name that has left an indelible mark on the world of South Korean entertainment and the global phenomenon of Hallyu, Korean wave. Born on 29 August, 1972, in Seoul, South Korea, by Yong Joon's journey to becoming one of the most iconic figures in the Korean entertainment industry is a remarkable tale of talent, dedication, and international acclaim. Early Life and Career Beginnings By Yong Joon's early life was marked by a passion for acting and a relentless pursuit of excellence in his crafts. He attended the prestigious Seoul National University of Arts where he honed his acting skills and laid the foundation for his future success. His talent was evident even during his early acting roles in television dramas and films. One of the turning points in his career came in 2002 when he starred in the immensely popular drama Winter Sonata. The series, which also featured actress Choi Ji-woo, became a cultural phenomenon in South Korea and Japan, catapulting both actors to international stardom. By Yong Joon's portrayal of the charismatic and sensitive character, Kang Joon Sang, resonated deeply with audiences, and he quickly gained a dedicated following. The Hallyu Wave Pioneer Winter Sonata not only established by Yong Joon as a leading Hallyu star but also played a pivotal role in initiating the Hallyu Wave, which would later sweep across Asia and beyond. The drama's success in Japan was particularly significant, 
with Bai Yongjun's popularity skyrocketing to unprecedented heights. His image as the ideal romantic hero captured the hearts of countless fans and earned him the moniker Yon's armor. In addition to his acting prowess, Bai Yongjun's good looks, charm, and gentlemanly demeanor contributed to his status as a beloved figure. His influence extended beyond the screen as he became a sought-after model, endorsing numerous products and brands. Business Ventures and Philanthropy Bai Yongjun's entrepreneurial spirit led him to explore various business ventures. He established the entertainment company Boff, Bai Yongjun's official figure, in 2001, which managed his career and expanded into other areas of the entertainment industry. Boff played a crucial role in the global promotion of Korean culture and entertainment. Beyond his professional success, Bai Yongjun has also been actively involved in philanthropy. He has supported various charitable causes and initiatives, including educational programs and disaster relief efforts. His commitment to giving back to society has earned him respect not only as an entertainer but also as a compassionate and socially responsible individual. Personal life and legacy. Bai Yongjun's personal life has been relatively private with much of the media attention focused on his career and contributions to the entertainment industry. In 2015, he tied the knot with actress Park Soo-jin, and the couple welcomed two children, marking a new chapter in his life. As Bai Yong-joon celebrates his 50s, he continues to be a revered figure in South Korean entertainment, admired for his acting talent, business acumen, and dedication to promoting Korean culture worldwide. His influence on the Hallyu wave remains undeniable, and his legacy as a pioneer of Korean pop culture endures. In conclusion, Bai Yongjun's journey from a young aspiring actor to a global Hallyu icon is a testament to his talent, hard work, and the cultural impact of Korean entertainment. His contribution to the Korean wave and his lasting legacy as a beloved figure in the industry will continue to inspire generations of fans and aspiring artists worldwide. Bai Yongjun's story is a true reflection of the power of dedication and passion in achieving greatness in the world of entertainment. May your journey continue to be filled with achievements and bliss alongside your loved ones, Bai Yongjun. As someone who has been captivated by your performances, I'm eagerly anticipating any new films or projects you undertake in the upcoming year. Your contribution to the world of entertainment has left an enduring impact and I hope your future endeavors bring even more joy and success. Wishing you a year ahead filled with new adventures and happiness.